Good afternoon and welcome to Nora's Dog Training Company. We're here this afternoon with Bear and Rich. And what we're going to be demonstrating for you today on video is Bear's ability to understand and respond to his formal on-leash obedience commands. The little tiny corrections and lots of motivation, Rich is using a clicker and treats that we give the puppies when we're working with them and the training equipment that we're using. Rich is using a regular six foot web training leash and he keeps the bulk of the leash folded neatly in his right hand, which leaves his left hand free to give any correction that's needed. And the only correction that we give is a little tug and release on the training collar. And you'll be introduced to all of those things tomorrow when you come to get there. Now he is sitting very nicely next to Rich's left leg and the first exercise that they're gonna demonstrate for you is healing. The command is bear heal, and at this point, bear has a job to do. And that is to walk nicely next to your left leg, not forging ahead or lagging behind, but keeping pace with you, making good eye contact, and when he does a good job, Rich will give him a click and sometimes a little treat. This is your sit stay. Stay is a hand and a voice command and because it is a stationary exercise, it is a one word command. Your long sit stay when you're practicing at home, you're gonna start out at about 20 or 30 seconds and you're gonna slowly work up to three minutes over the next couple of months. And it will take you that long because he's young, he has a short attention span, Beautiful automatic sits. He does that perfectly. When you stop your feet, he sits. So when you're walking and you go to cross traffic or talk to someone on the street, he's sitting. Stay. This is again your sit stay. And this time instead of returning back to him, Rich will demonstrate the recall or the come on command. And he comes and sits beautifully. And that eliminates the jumping. So always make him sit when you call him. He likes to put his nose on the ground. So you see Rich giving him that little tug and release on the training collar so that he does it. I think there's a little hound in there. And a little dachshund. <laughs> Now, dogs will itch to distract you. It's not that he's really itchy. Rich calls him again. That was very nicely done. He did that with a lot of self-control because he knows he's going to get a reward. And he, he did it very well. Now the next commands that we're going to demonstrate, we have a little mat out here for him. And if you have a dog bed at home or something like that, that you can make his place, you can tell him place and then down and stay. And your long down stays when you're practicing at home. Again, you're going to start out at 30 minutes, 30 seconds to a minute and you're going to work up to five minutes. When Rich returns back, he just walks right back to his shoulders. <laughs> that healing is too funny. Back onto his mat. He knows. doing a really good job and the weather was kind enough to let us get this video done today nice recall so we have demonstrated for you some of the new skills that bear has learned while he's been with us here at school we've enjoyed having him he's come a long way in a short period of time thank you for choosing Nora's dog training company and we will see you tomorrow